Welcome to this video tutorial from CoreTechnologies.com. Today we are going to show you how to run a VirtualBox virtual machine as a Windows service with Always Up. Once we are done, your VM will start immediately when your computer boots and will keep running 24-7 in the background, even if no one ever logs on. Let's get started. First, if you haven't already done so, download, install, and configure VirtualBox. Please ensure that your virtual machine starts normally from VirtualBox. Be sure to install the VirtualBox extension pack if you intend to use VirtualBox's remote display feature to connect to your VM. Next, download and install Always Up from CoreTechnologies.com. Start Always Up and select Application, then Add to open the Add Application window. In the Application field, enter the full path to the vboxheadless.exe application, which allows you to start a VM without a graphical interface. If you installed VirtualBox in the default location, this is c colon slash program files slash oracle slash virtualbox slash vboxheadless.exe. In the Arguments field, enter Start VM, then your virtual machine name. The virtual machine name is the name of the VirtualBox VM you would like to start automatically. Our VM is called Debian, so we have entered Start VM Debian. In the Name field, enter the name that you will call the application in Always Up. We have used Debian VM, but you can specify virtually anything you like. Click over to the Logon tab and enter the username and password of the account where you have run your virtual machine successfully, probably the one you were logged into right now. Always Up will run your VM in this account so that it can find its settings. Click over to the Startup tab and check the Ensure that the Windows Network Components have started box. This informs Always Up that VirtualBox needs the TCP IP networking stack to operate. In order to save your VM state when it stops, move to the Extras tab and check the Use this special command to stop the application box. Specify the full path to the vboxmanage.exe application along with a few arguments. C colon slash program files slash oracle slash virtualbox slash vboxmanage.exe control vm virtual machine name save state. Your virtual machine name is the name of your VM. Again, this is Debian in this tutorial. Check the Wait for Up To box and enter 30 in the accompanying field. This informs Always Up to wait for up to 30 seconds for VirtualBox to exit properly before forcibly closing it. Click the Save button. In a couple of seconds, an application called Debian VM will show up in the Always Up window. It is not yet running, though. To start the virtual machine, we'll choose Application, then Start Debian VM. The state should transition to running after a few seconds, and the VM should be working in the background. That's it. Next time your computer boots, your VM tunnel will start immediately, without anyone needing to log on. Please restart your PC and test that everything works as expected after Windows reboots. We encourage you to edit the entry in Always Up and explore the many other settings that may be appropriate for your environment. For example, send email alerts if the VM stops, hide the console, boost priority, and much more. Thank you for watching.